<laughs> okay, welcome guys to another video today. We're going to react to Avengers Endgame trailer hashtag tour 2019 as movie clip trailer. Yeah, um, I yeah, the reason why the growing star is because I just filmed it and it didn't work. Well, yeah, we, so I'm gonna play it. How it's gonna go, I'm gonna play it all, and then my reaction. So. Like a thousand years ago, I fought my way out of that cave, became Iron Man, realized I loved you. I know I said no more surprises, but I was really hoping to pull off one last one. The world has changed. None of us can go back. All we can do is our best. And sometimes the best that we can do is to start over. I saw all these people die. Telling everybody they should move on. Some do, but not us. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this to everyone who's not in this room to try. We will. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. I like this one. <laughs> Freaking April 26th, right? Okay, so that was <laughs> just playing it. Now I'm actually going to react to it, to hopefully, like everything I can. By the way, spoilers, I forgot to say that. <laughs> hopefully, it's the intro, so let's go through it and I'll try and. I'll, I'm sorry, I'll pause it a lot. Sorry, sorry. God, seems like a thousand years ago. So this is after Avengers 1, by the way, I think. I'm pretty sure. I fought my way out of that cave. Became Iron Man. Realized I loved you. So he's talking to his helmet to send a message to Earth to Pepper Potts. Pepper Potts? Which I think is still alive, because if not, most of the story, most, like, in the trailer, both the trailers it shows, a clip like this, him talk, me taking a message to Pepper, so it makes sense if it wouldn't make sense if it wa wasn't she wasn't live. She would get that like what? And also, I'm pretty sure she he's in a ship with Nebula, the robot that was a that was it's half a machine, but he's freaking Thanos, and a no I think another person. Don't know what that is. I'm sorry. I think that's the um. Reactor, I think. Realized I loved you. I know I said no more surprises, but I was really hoping. I think that's the Guardians of the Galaxy ship. Jesus Christ! Oh yeah, because it is because they came from Titan, because that they're the only ones that didn't get snapped. So it makes sense. And then trying to go back to Earth, but I think like the first one they say is like they're running low. They're gonna run out of oxygen soon. I, and before I'll come back to it, yeah. Hoping to pull off one last one. The world has changed. Isn't that an old version of Captain America? And it's all black and 
red now. So I think it's showing like this is what happens in the past. What's black and red and what happens in colour is what actually is the part present and future. None of us can go back. Remember that's I think how it looks like when it's been half snapped like None of us can go back. Not really a normal state. Hawkeye finally making another appearance. Can we just get a clap for Hawkeye finally coming back to the movies? Yeah, your movie tag was a really good movie, but still come back to Avengers. I think that's his daughter practicing the archery. I'm um, yeah. All we can do. Look, look how happy he is. Is our best. And then it comes to this thing. I've got two theories. His family got snapped, and he's just outraged. And I think. Hopefully this is not. Isn't it rogue? No, I don't know. Like, Ronin. That's his. I think it's Ronin, yeah, I think he becomes Ronin. Or maybe a scroll's taken over him. I don't know, Captain Marvel was a great movie, depends. <laughs> watch it. If you haven't watched it, leave. Um, but scrolls end up being good. <laughs> and, um, yeah. So maybe there's always bad people, and, like, yeah. Sometimes the best that we can do is to stop. Black Widow and Hawkeye. Uh, like, so they're together in the movie? No, you know what I meant, like, so whoever's with Black Widow it must be with Hawkeye. I feel like that's a past scene from another movie of Captain America. Like, I think when he just got unfrozen and that's his wife, that was really old, I don't know. Maybe that's something that got faded. You ruined yourself! So they've basically said, yeah, we're doing past. You're doing this time travel. Be so that means they must be get the time stone. So look, because there's freaking on Osgard, which you know, in Thor Ragnarok, got destroyed by the big fly dude. Yeah, that's how Thor's sister died. Dad and the old Thor. No one liked that Thor. I saw red and black again. All these people die. <gasps> okay, okay, okay. Scarlet Witch. She got power from I think a stone that I think got a power her power from a stone. So and did you see how she destroyed Vision's gem, Mind Stone? The stones have power to destroy other stones, which means Captain Marvel. She, if she's, I think she's in this movie, got just so her ship shop, when a a uh, ship got destroyed, like blown up the, with the test track. She consumed all the test track, which is also the space stone, and basically has the power of the space stone, which can also destroy other infinity stones. So that's. She could destroy one of the stones to prevent the click snap. You know? You might just take this time stone like yunk. I keep telling everybody they should move on. Some do, but not us. Okay, and men got out of the uh, the realm. I forgot what the freaking realm is called <laughs> after. So I don't know how, but he did, and now he's really confused, like, what? Everyone's dead? What? I mean, everyone's wanted? What? Like, the post is all that, everything's destroyed. I don't know how he got out, but I hope that's, like, the first scene, him getting out and showing us how. Hopefully. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this. 
I think that's when it didn't get sad because it, it looks pretty good to us. To everyone who's not in this room, to try. Red, red hair. To everyone who's not in this room, red hair. To try. That's a dirty combo because he's got a freaking a lot of explosives. No, rocket. Oh. Okay, look at the background of this. Captain Marvel in the background. Oh, hopefully they didn't record that. Hopefully they didn't destroy it. Okay, in that background, Captain Marvel, one of the most place this place is set. At uh, Captain Marvel's friend, um, that black lady. I forgot. I'm not trying to be right. Um, that I think that's her house because that's like a good design of it. And in the comics, I'm pretty sure the uh, daughter that chose the design of Captain Marvel, um, the daughter of. Captain Marvel's best friend. It's hard because I don't know the names. Okay. Um, in the comics, she was a hero, like a superhero. So maybe they just thought, hey, comics are good. They're coming to me. Maybe they're just there because to get Captain Marvel. That could be why they're there as well. Like we haircut, interest more. Well, okay, interesting. Whatever it takes. And man in a suit. And Thor just thundering. Stormbreaker, I'm pretty sure he hasn't switched. And now we're looking pissed as I think she's next to Thor or something, Thanos or something, and ready to bash the frick out of him. Whatever it takes. New style again. She has three ha hairstyles in the whole movie. Like, three ha hairstyles in one movie. Whatever it takes. Okay, they're saying whatever it takes, which makes me think there's a sacrifice in the movie. <laughs> Everyone thinks it's Captain America, but I think it's Iron Man. Old Shield, Ant Man fighting in pencil. Pencil. I think this is like in Avengers One because there was an office workplace. I, I think. Whatever it takes. Okay, so Iron Man says whatever it takes last, which I think he's taking a sacrifice. And what I think is, like, in the whole movies, there's a theory going on right now about his left arm being damaged nearly every single movie he's in. The first one, the se like, whi Whiplash, I said, no. The second one, Whiplash destroyed his arm in the, in the robot thing, in the, um, what he sees. His left arm is damaged and freaking red. Like, he's gotten dropped on it, he's been, he, like, a lot of things happened to his left arm. Plus, Thanos destroyed it, like, destroyed his armor from it, and then actually, his, his, his left arm is really damaged. And, what? Go what? Where's the gauntlet? Which hand is the gauntlet in? Freaking left! Does that mean Ant Iron Man takes the gauntlet, undoes the snap? Saves the world, but takes a sacrifice because it says whatever it takes, which is making me think there's a sacrifice. And also, Doctor Strange said it was the only chance by by letting Iron Man survive. Which means Iron Man has an important role. He started it. He will end it in the back. okay. It takes sick things. By the way, Nebula's right there. Remember that. And there's someone else. There's numbers again. There's someone. That's the question mark person. And Nebula's there. Who's in front of Iron Man? They didn't show Iron Man until the last one because they want to leave that uh, Captain America and Iron Man now staying together. Captain Marvel, I think that's... I don't know where that place is. I think that's the Stormbreaker. I, when I was talking about it, the first one I thought it was a different pe uh, act, but I think it's the Stormbreaker. I like this one. Okay. Black Widow's there. I think that's Black Widow. Remember what, remember what I said? Hawkeye is with Black Widow? That means Black Widow, Hawkeye, Thor, and Captain Marvel, I think. April 26th. Thank you for watching. Please comment down what theories you're believing. 
leaving and comment down what theories you think I said is correct. Thank you and goodbye.